Uh, Bobby Miller, give me uh, give me where where he's at on on yours because he's kind of he's kind of losing some trust for me. Um, big thing for him. What did he say over his first few few games? I just threw everything that Will Smith called. And now it seems like he's kind of shaking him off. He's kind of going to the fastball. He's kind of going to the fastball. He's kind of going to the fastball. And then they know the fastball is coming, which was the thing the you know the Dodgers were worried about uh, before he made his debut. That and a lot of you know baseball experts that uh, he gets too fastball heavy, um, fastball happy, and then they hit it. And we're seeing it get hit right now. When it gets hit, he gets rattled. And then it gets hit more, or he overthrows the next pitch, and that goes, uh, you know, shout out Lamont Wade for taking that that curveball yard, which was a was that was a good hit. Could have got down a little bit more, but uh, where are you at? So I would say Bobby Miller, the talent is still undeniable, right? The stuff is still undeniable. You see that the results, though, after a fantastic start, had the point seven eight ERA through his first four starts, last two starts, a twelve ten ERA through nine and two thirds. And I think to me, the big takeaway is when the wheels fall off for Bobby Miller, the wheels fall off pretty hard. It's like when you're driving and you kind of get off the road and you try to oversteer and you overcorrect. And that's when you make things worse. I think that's what we see with Bobby Miller because you see him when he's out there on the mound. He gets himself into trouble, falls into holes. You saw the top of the fifth inning, gives up that single to Jolks, and then he walks Myers. So that compounds the fact. So you let the bottom of the lineup there start to get some momentum. And then what really threw him off, though, was the unexpected bunt single. He almost felt like, oh, you shouldn't bunt on me what are you doing there right and that really throws him off then he goes back gives up the home run to Bregman there on that 98 mile per hour sinker that was up and in and then he walks Tucker then gives up the double to Abreu and then Diaz single so yeah they kind of left him out there to dry a little longer than I probably would have liked but still these are the necessary growing pains and what I will say about Bobby Miller is that if you ever did want to see him in October people were talking about maybe a week or two ago Clint I want him as my game one starter, right? I want him to be a guy that could possibly starting in the game one of a big postseason I series. I kind of do, to be honest. That, and that's fine. <laughs> and that's and no, no, Clint. I'm saying that's fine. I'm saying you want these growing pains in June because that'll pay dividends in October. Because he'll realize, hey, it's about throwing strikes. And here, I'll tell you something: 62% strikes in his last two starts. That is going to get it done. You see some nibbling with him despite having that stuff. So really, it's about getting first pitch strike. It's about fastball command. It's also about Noah doing the gritty. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.